Ladies and gentlemen, can I please have your attention? I'm not gonna lie, I can't love the attention. <laughs> What's up, too chewy? My mom warned me about friends like you. You're overwhelming. Hey, I'm here for the ride. <laughs> Al. And it's Taku. Listen, guys, uh, early on during the week, we had Ali, the senior entertainment reporter from the Daily Mail, come in and tell us some crazy ass stories about these crazy celebrities, right? So, some of them even include Jay Z and Usher. But look, listen, I don't want to spoil too much, but if you want to hear how he sneaks into some of the biggest parties in the world, here it is. Going off like Australian reality TV and stuff like that, I heard something about Jay Z. Ah. Tell us your interaction with Jay Z. With Jay Z? A few years ago, because this was, was going, this, a, was, this okay. was on TMZ and everything. This was Whoa. everywhere. So it... obviously, I love Beyonce. That's no secret. Mm. She was at a movie premiere. I don't even remember. Mo- this was in New York. Mm. Mm. Naturally, I'm just going to walk wait at the back door of the premiere for her to walk out, so I can wow. get a selfie with her. Mm. You're That's not going to pass right that there. Op- yeah. opportunity. And then, so she had three Escalades waiting for her at the back, and I could see Julius, her bodyguard, who's like sort of famous. You know her. Mm. Beyonce's bodyguard is he kept eyeing the one car so I said let me wait at this one car and wow. so, 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 so you see so I waited at the one car they had three car. like a decoy yeah. and then she was to come out so as soon as I saw Julius eye that one car while all her friends went to the other cars You're I like just action. went waited at the corner like sprinted God damn. phone out ready to go like video mode on ready to go and I'm just like Hey, Beyonce, can I get a selfie with you and actually beat, got to her before her bodyguard or Jay-Z, like, even walked out of the room. Wow. Wow. And then he, Julius turned around, saw me, but before he, the bodyguard could even push me or get to me, uh, Jay-Z just grabbed my, like, because I tried to put my arm around her, <laughs> grabbed me, and then put, like, just shoved me to the side, and I was just, whoa. God yeah. damn. But, like... You're trying to grab the queen right there. The sad thing is, she was really happy to do it. Like, in the selfie, like, she's full smiling, everything. Like, the photo worked. It sucks because it's iPhone and it's dark. Uh Mm. It worked. It was a good story. Probably the craziest story because after Uh that, everyone's like, oh, my God, you just got hit. And then I just... I didn't want it to be a story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nah, I didn't so, get hit. It was, it was. I ran away. Like, I ran away, right? Little did I know, in one of the other Escalades was Usher. What? what the- watching this. So the next day, I was actually waiting at a hotel, and I saw him. I've tried to meet Usher for years. How do you know Usher was at this hotel? Uh, oh, no, I was waiting for another celebrity. Who were you waiting on? I don't even remember, to be honest. Yeah, waiting for another celebrity I was, I was waiting Usher's... for the Jonas Brothers. And See, then Usher walked out, right? Oh, my god. And then goodness, I'm like, okay. oh, can I get a photo with you? Mm. And then he didn't, wasn't too keen to do it. And I said, oh, I actually met you in Australia a few years ago. What's funny enough, I was actually, it was here at this radio station. I ran into the car park. <laughs> but <laughs> you're a Nova. You're, yeah. so you're, this is why you're the reason why security is so I, I ran, so I ran into the car park to try and meet him, right? And he, I think it was an incident. <laughs> um, and then I said, so I brought it up with him. Like, yeah, this was just me and Asha, right? And I said, oh, I, I tried to meet you in Australia years ago. And then he goes, hang on. Is this at the radio station? I said, yes, that's me. Oh. And then he goes, what happened? Then he goes, what happened with you and Jay-Z? Oh. I said, what? Oh. He saw you get hit. <laughs> well, yeah. He goes, what happened? Because all over TMZ, Vogue, Hollywood Yo. Reporter, everywhere. And you didn't said, even know that it was on TMZ at that point. Jay-Z, man- no, this was, sorry, the next day. Uh. So it said, Jay-Z uh, manhandles crazed fan. Poor. And that it was is me. a story to half. And then I just told him, I said, I was just trying to get a selfie with Beyonce. With and he, he laughed. And I got, got, he's just like, okay, I'll take a photo with you. Damn. And so man's photo. had to question you just so that he can give you a photo. Come on, guys. What are they doing out here, man? But boy, that is a story. But he was so nice. That I was like, he he came out and he was so nice. I was, oh, my photos God. Photos up on my Insta. Wow, man. Wow. Because I've, yeah. like, I've always wondered how you get yourself positioned in the right place at the right time. I've been seeing like photos of you with like Harry Styles and you know what I'm saying? All these photos like with like these big time people. And I'm like, how yeah. the hell does all these these Instagram is just, I, I thought it was photoshopped. But when I, first I went swear to God, that's what I thought too at one point. And then I'm like, this is actually real. This is real. Like, he's, with the biggest, my photos. He's, he's with the biggest celebrities. Like, uh, I'll give you another crazy story. Oh my God, yeah. let's you go. You heard it here first. So one time I was in New York at Fashion Week. I wanted to get into a party because it was like bedlam outside, crazy with all the paps. Mm. Kendall Jenner walks in with like this flowy dress. 
Wow. She had like five minders all around her. Mm. And for <laughs> I was a bit drunk. Uh-uh. But I grabbed her dress, like, and she thought I was like an event person and walked in with her. Oh! Uh, there's photo- there's actually there's, there's, No <laughs> way. So Kendall actually, Jenner's walking into this event. There's actually Maybe he's holding it more like as if he's working with her, bro. <laughs> yeah. But do you know what the funniest part of it all was? So I walked in into the party. I went into the lift with her. It was like me, Kendall, her friend, her manager, like two bloody big security guards. Yeah. And the funniest part of it, I was like, I was well dressed, right? They thought I was an event person. Oh, and the event what? people thought I was with Kendall. Oh my So as soon goodness. as I walked into this party, they're like, it's this way. I walk into <laughs> the room. There's maybe about 30 people. It was some fashion awards. About 30 people inside this room. And I, I got, I was like really nervous. So I went straight to the bar, just had a few drinks, yeah. waited for it to finish because I needed the selfie with Kendall, obviously. But little, they were actually filming an episode of the Kardashians there. So Kim was there, Scott Disick, Chris Jenner, um, Cindy Crawford's daughter, Kaya Gerber. And then as soon as it was over, I just ran straight up to Kendall first. And then... This is crazy. Um, the others. Oh my goodness! So yeah, I, 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 I heard it first, and so that's like, that's a good bit of advice. So that was Kendall first. Oh, you're showing some photos now, yeah. And then Chris Jenna. Oh my god! Like security in the back. That's such nice photos. Kim, when she had like the bl- she was was when she oh first god. had the blonde, mm. and like they went in and out of this venue in the car park. So like a normal person outside on the street could not get to them. Yeah, and Damn. how how are they in in real life? Nicest people you'll ever meet. And really? like I think that's another great example of you can be the biggest celebrity and you can still be nice. Like mm-hmm. when people ask me who the nicest celeb you've ever met is, I always say Kim, and you're the bigger the celebrities are, the more nicer and humble wow. they are. Yeah, like I, Kim I K. Be the opposite. Also, that's what I thought too. <laughs> no, yeah. Angelina Jolie, Brad Pitt, um, Johnny Depp, nicest people you'll ever meet. And you met all those people. Yeah. And wow. they're probably the nicest I've met. Oh, wow.